Oscar Raymond Knight and Earl W. Bascom pioneered the sport of rodeo in Canada in the early 1900s and continued to build the sport for another 40 years. Raymond Knight started the Raymond Stampede in 1902, the first organized rodeo in Canada. It wasn't an arena or a grandstand, it was held in a vacant lot up in the middle of town. It's still running to this day, taking place over the July long weekend. In 1903, Knight invented the Bronc Riding Chute. Earl Bascom and his brothers later adapted the design to create the first side delivery chute. By 1919, Bascom and his father further modified the design by reversing the chute gate so that it hinged by the horse's head, forcing the horse to turn as it left the chute, making it much safer for the cowboy as he exited. Ray Knight is considered the father of Canadian calf roping, having first introduced the event to Canadian rodeo. He was the world champion at the North American Calf Roping Championships in 1924 and 1926. In the early 1900s, Knight had more rodeo stock than anyone else in rodeo history with over 2,000 bucking horses. Ray Knight has been inducted into the Canadian Rodeo Hall of Fame, the Raymond Sports Hall of Fame, the Lethbridge Sports Hall of Fame, and now the Alberta Sports Hall of Fame. He left a legacy, and his biggest le legacy was the Raymond Stampede, because he was father of Stampede. Earl Bascom was a rodeo contestant from 1916 to 1940 and is still considered one of the greatest innovators in rodeo history. Bascom designed rodeo's first hornless bronc saddle, the first one-handed bareback rigging, and the high-cut riding chaps. On top of being a contestant and innovator, Bascom was a shoot man, hazer, pick man, trick rider, bullfighter, clown, and announcer. Earl W. Bascom has been inducted into the Utah Sports Hall of Fame and the Canadian Rodeo Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the Alberta Sports Hall of Fame 2013 inductees Oscar Raymond Knight and Earl W. Bascom.